Hello, this is Kalotron, please, and welcome back to another episode of Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. In the last episode, guys, we started the second game in the series, Crash Bandicoot 2, Cortex Strikes Back. And we played through Turtle Woods and Snow Go. And to be fair, these levels are actually quite a lot nicer, and I think better, than the first game. But today, we're going to be playing Hang 8 and possibly the pits in Crash Dash. So if you like the sound of that, please make sure to drop a like on the video. And if you really enjoy, please make sure to subscribe and share this video with your friends. But anyway, let's... Before I go in, I just want to say I'm doing... I'm going to start doing more Crash Bandicoot episodes and doing them on Mondays as well. Just because this second game, it's got me so much more into playing. Like it's, I find this one a lot more exciting and fun to play than the first one. So I'll be playing it more often. And... Here we go, into the first level for today, Hang 8. No, we're not doing Hang 10, guys. We're not Hanging 10, we're Hanging 8. So, yeah. Hint, failing a bonus path doesn't cost lives, so retry it. Yes, I already know that. That's why I retry those levels so much. And another feature I like about this game, in comparison to the other, is you have these little starting areas, which are always, always quite cool and fun to mess around in. And here we go. What was this level called again? Hang 8. Okay, this is cool. Nice as tech looking platforms here with the moving. There was like moving platforms. Ooh, Robo Bitch. That's also cool. And here's another moving platform thing. Let's jump on and off. And yeah. Oh, got a toxic piranha plant thing here. What do we do with this one? Just spam it. Yeah, that's nice. Simple hit thing there. And Crash has a surfboard, guys. He crash has a surfboard. Oh, wait. There's a timer. Oh. We can accelerate and boost. Is this the level? Yes, this is the main part of the level. And the timing. It's being timed, so. Oh, I don't know what to do here. Go through this gap. Yeah, that seems good. We got an extra life. And it's all cool and fun. We can top off at this checkpoint. We have to, I didn't realize there was a timer. It's in the bottom corner of the screen there. And can we... Yeah, I think we can go through this checkpoint to try and... Oh wait, this is still encountered the main time for the level. No, okay. I really want that timer to reset. I'm, I'm really hoping that timer resets. Does it? It didn't appear this time. Does the timer only appear when I'm on the, like, on the board? Maybe it does. Anyway, let's go smash up these boxes, get a ton of mangoes, and take down these boxes as well. Okay, stand back a bit. Wait for the explosion to happen. That's nice. You can't up here, crash. You can... Oh yeah, I forgot we can slide. So is it circle? Yeah, that's it. You can slide and crouch and... Oh, what was crash doing there? Just do the little hokey pokey dance there. And find mangoes and boxes. This... I'm just listening to the music now. The music for this little bonus stage is so nice and relaxing. And peaceful. And I think all the boxes. That's nice. Now let's head back into the level. Boom. We've got a total of 74 boxes to smash in this level, and no, the timer hasn't reappeared, so I think we're good. And anyway, that time, that um, that thing is now a checkpoint, and oh, we need a gem to go here. Well, we should, we, we should have thought about that when we were playing some earlier levels, and oh, we have, we have hippos to go over here, and there's a crystal we need to get for this level. Okay, well, we still got six, we have six lives left. That should be enough to go through this stage with. And, you know, beat it reasonably well. And, okay. So, what's the deal with these hippos? Can I just... I don't think I can stay on them for long. But here we go. We, have, we now have the main master crystal for this level. So, that's a good thing. And there we go. New checkpoint. And I think the... Um, oh, I think the time was just for the, the boarding section. But we don't have it this time. And, oh no. Crash died. Yikes, mines are explosive and bad for you, Crash. Next time, we should avoid them. But let's get these boxes anyway. Go through here. And, okay. I want to avoid all these mine things. And boost up a ramp. Yes! That's, that's a nice, sweet bonus box. And we can do it again. Yes! Avoid the mines. That's how we do it. Crash. Crash Beandicoot. And spin away a plant. Through this. And, ooh. Oh, at the end of the level already? Wow! This... 
these levels, like they're short, but they are fun. They are they aren't difficult, they're fun and easy to do. And I like that new mechanic there. That hoverboard that um surfboard thing down there. That was actually really cool. I thought like that was the main theme of this level, but that was epic. Like, I actually, I want to do that a level again at some point. Because that was just fun, overall. And let's see that crystal come out. Ugh, crash. I don't think your crystals are meant to go in your mouth. Oh, here's the cortex crystals, again. Crystals, not bad. I see you are getting the hang of it. I need to conserve power. I will communicate with you again after you retrieve the fifth crystal. Okay, so after we complete Crash Dash... He's gonna have another chat with us in. It seems like in each of these stages we can replay it with a timer challenge or some sort of thing, but I don't care about that. Let's just go straight to the next level, the pits. So let's head in, pass all the vimes and stuff into another Aztec looking level. Okay, hit break lock boxes with a well aimed body slam. Body slam? How to do a body slam? I, I don't. Okay, I think I have, may have an idea. Like, we can slide by running and pressing the crouch button. So, okay, here's crouch, here's drift, and then, so wait, if I jump and then press crouch, Crouch can do a flipping body slam! Wow! Even more moves to this incredible moveset. Let's body slam that box and be on out of here, fools! And, like, there is a flipping. Why on earth is there a flipping. That thing. Aye, aye, aye. Uh, let's... Okay, we got another life in Mangos at least. But oh, that was just like... I think the difference between this game and the last game is with all the enemies, they've just been torn to turn into like cyborg things. That's it, that's all I can say with them. And we got a bunch more Mangos. And here's another cyborg bird. Let's jump on top of him. We don't even need to hit him, actually. And... Okay, we got this nice shelter section. Kind of cool, I guess. But yeah, here's the first checkpoint. That was nice and easy, and let's start smashing more boxes. Come on, crash. Just seeing that, seeing that thing in the background there. Oh, that cyborg bird. But I, I love that body slam. This body slam thing is amazing. Come on, jump on the bird. Oh, I'm... Cyborg turtle with saws? What's up with that thing? That's ridiculous, but okay, we have... We have two paths to go down here, so I'll take this path. Looks more dangerous, but you know, why not? Let's avoid these flipping saw turtles and can I go around them? Yes, I can. That was some nice platform moves from us here. So, let's make another move. In between the turtles of death and slicing, and we've hit a checkpoint. I wonder if we got a checkpoint if we went around the other way. And oh, now we see the two varieties, spike and saw. But fortunately, they're not too difficult at all to get past. So let's move on through, get up some more boxes, and keep on going. We, hit, we see another birdie there. We're just gonna keep on going. Hey, birdie, you can't stop the flow. <laughs> yeah, so you can't stop the flow even though you got hit. We got our friend, Aku Aku, to get the smacky smacky down on your face. Boom. Second checkpoint already. I'm loving this. And let's do some nice jumpy jumps on the mole's heads. Come on, boom. Moles, get taken down to town, get taken out of here, nice, and we mushroom our way out. I think this is like the first level a little, and oh, getting dropped down again, okay, this is kind of cool, and oh, I reckon these are these supporting crates, so if I body slam, I can body slam those crates, that's what I do, oh, that's cool, okay, so, oh, I, I smashed up those, and now, what happened, what's going to happen next, okay, that's fine, go just, Slide on through, and crash calls on through still. You can do it, crash. Well done. One, two, three, four, five of the boxes. One, oh. You know, next time I think I'm not gonna bother getting all the boxes. Let's just, okay. Check, here's the thing. Drop down. Let's just flip in. Let's get this one, and that was it. Okay. Got all them. Body slam down on this thing, and just, just mangaroonie. It's Mango Mango, Mango Tango, and just up here, nice body slam slides, and get back in here, I don't want to fall off this level at all, and come on, bounce, bounce, and just make it over here, nicely done crash, 
and body slam these boxes. Boom. Boom, body slam boxes. That's, that, that's what I like to hear. And, oh, it's got that. That's, that's crashy and again another life. I like that a lot. I like that a lot, crashy boy. Crashy, my boy. And boom, out of here, out of this bonus level. We got some more boxes and more lives. That's what I like to see. So, that should now be a checkpoint for us. And let's hit it. Is this another life? No, it's just some more manga rubies. That should be fine. Hit some moles. That's all this part of the level is for. So, let's just spin away and bounce on out of here. That's what I like to see, crap. And, ooh, more, more spike turtles. Should be able to just jump over this one, though. Because he doesn't have a suit on his back. And let's go. More mole time action. Let's just spin, spin it to win it. Spin it to win it. I just, I really like, I don't need to jump on these moles, actually. I can just spin them away. And, ooh, yeah. End of the level. I like that. These, these levels, they're short and fun to play. That's what I like to hear. And, should we... Should we go for the next level? You know, why not? We have we have time enough. Let's go for one final level and see if Cortex returns to give us some info on why he needs all the crystals. Or something like that. You know, he's probably gonna say something back to us to get us motivated to get him more crystals, but here we go, where do you put where do What? Oh! Oh no! I haven't got the crystal from this level. We didn't find the crystal. Oh, we went down the wrong path. Guys, we have to rush back in. Ah, oh, midway through the level, we had to go left or right. We went right, and we didn't get the crystal. It must be down the left one. Okay, I think what we're going to do now is just try to speed through this level. So let's, let's go speed mode. Come on. You got this crash. We can speed back through and get this crystal. No probs. Just... Avoid turtles. Turtles are enemies and make always make left turns. That's what we've learned, Crash. Okay. Here comes this dude. Jump over him. We gotta we gotta completely ace this level now to so just boom. We can speed it. Speed it. We know how to do this. Jump over all those guys and just run through everything else. Okay. Got it. Nice. When you when you're not bothering about when it's not your first time playing through a level, it's actually a lot easier. You're not you're not as stressed. And, yeah, that's just keep going through. Okay. Now make a left turn here. And hopefully the crystal should be down this way somewhere. Because it wasn't down the other way, so it has to be down this way. And, ooh, you see a giant tree? That's, I don't think that's got anything to do with anything, but let's just keep going here. And, yeah, it's another checkpoint. This checkpoint is different to the, different to the other side. And I'm just going to jump through these armadillos gap. Oh, no. I didn't manage to make it, but have we hit a checkpoint already? Yes, we have. So it should not be too much other trouble. So let's jump on this guy. Failed it again like before, but anyway, here's the important bit. We need to get over here and get past armadillos to get our flipping crystal. Our crystal we need for Mr. Cortex Man. And this is kind of like another level in itself, because it's the other side of the level. So that's also fun to play through. And yeah, here's a checkpoint. And did you see that bird drop down? Probably gonna need to avoid him. So jump and spin. Nice. And the crystal should be around here somewhere. Come on. Has to be around here. Yeah, oh I can see it. I can see the thing. So let's just jump over here. Just jump and spin. Nice. Jump and spin. Okay, didn't even have to hit him. But here is the master crystal dude. There we go. Now we can officially just we can just run through the rest of this level now. Know that we've Completed the main thing, got the crystal, so we can return it to Cortex later. This is just actually a lot relaxing now. Now that I've done that, it's just relaxing, taking it off my mind. I know, I now know, I don't have to do it again, just to, um, I now know, I don't have to play through the level again, just to get to one little bit. And yep, mangoes, don't care, just spinning away the moles. Moles in the hole, that's literally what they are. There's moles inside of this hole. Which I found. And okay, mangoes, nice and sweet. Onto the next pit. And we should be done after this. Uh, uh, yeah, after seeing this, how we didn't get the crystal the first time around, I'm not sure we'll have time to do the next level, guys. So, yeah, we finished now, but we've had to go through this level twice because of that little slip up. So, 
I, you know, I don't, I'm not sure that we'll be able to get another level in today. So, guys, I think that's about where we're going to wrap it up. After having missed a crystal the first time around of that level. But, yeah, we went into Hang 8, where we played some surfboarding levels. And that was actually quite fun. Decent fun, actually. Then, into the pits, where we found that you can get out of multiple places. And, again, Crash, don't put that up there. Anyway, guys... Thanks for watching. If you did enjoy seeing me complete these levels, please make sure to drop a like on the video. And if you want to see me play Crash Dash and find out what Cortex is up to, please make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified of when that video comes out. But thanks for watching, guys. This has been Kalatron Plays, and we'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!